aren't you? I think so. But yeah. I've never roomed with him, but we Matty Taylor and I've heard him through the walls, so definitely Matty. Yeah. Well, I think I've had a few reports that it's, it's me, so um, I think <laughs> I'll claim that one. That's, yeah, has it's to be, be has to be Chris Dent. Yeah, he's uh, renowned for his uh, for his kit being left everywhere and losing being, stuff. Yeah, yeah, Chris Dent. A few candidates for that, really, isn't there? Recently, it's been uh, Josh Shaw's been getting accused a little bit, hasn't he? Yeah, Premier Lounge has had a few biscuits gone missing, so <laughs> I think it's Shawsy. Yeah. No doubt, it's David Payne. Uh, 100% Payne, Flash Payne, likes, likes getting a bit of product in there. Doesn't want his product, cuts it himself. So cuts himself, yeah. Not bad effort. <laughs> you, you know well, I, I spent a winter with him in Melbourne, and that is definitely Jack Taylor, whose girlfriend confiscated his turtleneck. Um, I don't think he's actually got that back. He also had a t-shirt with four different materials in it, which was thrown on our roof um, and forced back down. So yeah, Jack Taylor without a doubt. There's a few that claim they got the best chat. Rod Roderick claims he's got the best chat, but I've experienced it firsthand and I've been told by friends and uh, other people that, that yeah, Roderick's chat is shocking. <laughs> I like to think he's Casanova, but he's anything but. 